The way I see it, you and me got one thing to talk about. One thing. And that's what you are willing to do for me. Pam Greer plays a flight attendant who was arrested while trying to smuggle cash into the United States for Samuel L. Jackson's character, an illegal gun merchant. In that scene from Jackie Brown, the long-awaited new film by Quentin Tarantino. It's been three and a half years since Tarantino's Pulp Fiction landed as the most influential movie of its time, and now Tarantino is back again with a picture built on colorful, low-life characters and a lot of high-quality dialogue. Greer's character, named Jackie Brown, knows Jackson plans to kill her before she can cooperate with the police, but she is way ahead of him there. Now let's say, if I tell on you, I walk. If I don't, I go to jail. Uh -huh. I want $100,000 in an escrow account in my name if I'm convicted up to a year or put on probation. Now, if I have to do more than a year, you pay another $100,000. I can do that. Another key character in the movie is a bail bondsman played in a wonderful performance by Robert Forster, who combines understated professionalism with all the weariness of a man who has spent too long doing a job that discourages him. Possession of unregistered machine guns. Damn. Now, they're going to consider that a violation of his probation. Michael Keaton and Michael Bowen play a federal agent and a local cop who are on Jackie Brown's trail. She sees through them, too, and sets them up as part of her complicated scam, which is designed to save her life and steal the money. You ever see him sell a gun? No. How do you know he sells a gun? He told me. Besides, why else would an ATF man be after him? The film is rich with sharply observed characters, including the gunrunner's girlfriend, played by Bridget Fonda, and his ex-con buddy, played by Robert De Niro. Uh, 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 here we go. AK-47, the very best there is. When you absolutely, positively got to kill every mother in the room, except no substitutes. Nothing gets between me and my AK. And this here is the Chinese model. I get them for 850. Double my money. Grab that for me, would you, baby? No, it's for you. Girl, don't make me put my foot in your ass. The AK-47 is the most popular assault rifle in the world. This is the Chinese model. You can tell by the extra rivets running through the Hello, it's for you. And Tarantino's dialogue there certainly owes more than a little to the novelist Elmore Leonard, whose rum punch inspired this movie. Jackie Brown shows Tarantino at his best, savoring the words and little details of behavior that make his characters so individual and original and memorable. The movie involves a complicated double cross by Jackie Brown, but it's also about her sweet and understated relationship with the bail bondsman. And in its own quiet way, the chemistry between Pam Greer and Robert Forster is the heart of the movie. Instead of hurtling toward a routine ending like a lot of caper films, Jackie Brown is about the process, not the payoff. This is a film that's too good to be in a hurry. Well, the dialogue is what is so distinctive about Tarantino's work. Frankly, if I had a script, I'd let him take a pass at it. Almost any <laughs> script, except maybe you know some 19th century English <laughs> drama or something. Uh, he's he's that good of a writer. Yes, he, is. he he's listened wherever he's been in the world. He's listened very very well. Um, I also like the fact, you know, when Pam Greer was announced for this project, everyone thought, well, this is going to be his riff on black exploitation movies. And I suppose with the, the theme song across 110th Street and all that, there is, there is some of that. But it's a whole lot more than that. He, he, oh. it, is a, it is a sweet love story, as it turns out. Yeah. And uh, he's just a darn good writer. I'm so pleased to hear what comes out of the character's yeah, mouth. And Pam Greer does not play an exploitation right. character. She yeah. plays a tired airline stewardess yeah. in her 40s yeah. who was about to lose probably the last job that she can get and yeah. is very desperate and is very smart yeah. and is thinking very hard. It's a real good performance because Pam Greer yeah. actually is much more glamorous in real life than she is in this movie well, and more energetic too. Inter, it, it's, a, it's a performance. Yeah, here. but in her, in her opening scene, I mean, he's paying a little bit tribute moving along a conveyor belt at the airport with that great soundtrack. Two thumbs up for the most entertaining Jackie Brown, featuring Quentin Tarantino's uncommonly good dialogue, as well as Pam Greer.